Derek, we'll get back to you in a few minutes. Now to a story you'll only see here. Over the years, infrastructure falls victim to the aging process, and that's why engineers are always out inspecting our roads and bridges. Yes, they are. And today, ODOT and the Ohio Turnpike Commission, they turn to a new technology to inspect a long bridge over the Sandusky River. Paul Kiska was there for that inspection. For years, ODOT bridge inspectors used these snooper trucks. But inspectors weren't able to see everything, including the middle of the bridge. In the near future, they could use drones equipped with cameras to reach hard to see places. Today, ODOT did a demonstration with this drone flying under the Sandusky Bridge and over the Sandusky River. ODOT says drones would save time, money, and would be safer. So we'll still use a human inspector, but they'll be reviewing the images. Our, our bridge engineers will do that, but they'll do it from the safety of a, of a lab or from a, their desk instead of from a snooper truck or dangling under a bridge to get the same information. The images captured by drones would show bridge inspectors exactly where repairs need to be done. We're also looking for deterioration on the bridges. Sensefly, the company that operates the drone, told me bridge inspections are only the beginning of possibilities for drones. So you can do water towers or certain types of features. We see cell phone towers, building faces, um, anything that's a vertical type of feature where we have guys climbing on them currently, you can actually use this type of drone for those type of inspections. From small bridges to big bridges, there are 914 bridges in ODOT District 12, which includes Cuyahoga County. Reporting from along the Ohio Turnpike, Paul Kiska, News Channel 5.